All right, everyone, so we are back in Jorvik, and we had a mission to meet Hafton here at the Royal Hall, so that's what I'm going to do. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back. Hopefully, it's going to be another action pack, jam pack episode of Assassin's Creed. Let's see what is next. Here we go. Let's talk. Let's speak with Hafton. Here we go. I wonder how Hafton fares now that he sits on the throne. <laughs> It looks like there's an empty throne. I don't see him here. Moira may know where Hafton has gone. Moira, is something wrong? Weep for Northumbria. Is it Hafton? Has he gotten worse? His heart is broken. He's a mere shadow of himself. With Faravid lost and his brothers away, he wallows in paranoia and sadness. I could speak with him. Where is he now? Wandering the fields of Pitteringa with his beloved Bayonton. I'll find him. Thank you, Moria. Pitteringa is in the east. Just follow the road to Scarborough. Right, everyone, so we have a little ways to go, I believe. I think we have a little ways to go, so uh, I guess I will see you all when we get to wherever we're heading. Yeah, it's pretty far difference. All right, everyone. I will see you when we get there. All right, everyone, this should be the area where we will find Hafton. There he is, right there. So let's uh, no speak with glory, him. Here we go. No hope. Nothing but snow, silent as a corpse in its grave. Stand up, Hafton. I'm taking you back to Jorvik. <laughs> up, my lord. You're a king. You're not allowed to sulk. Men bled and died to sit you on that throne. So go sit. My brother, Ivar. Did he die well? He died fighting. You slew my brother, and never said a word. You kept this from me! It was no secret. Abba knew. Did he not... Leave me! I will not. I've come to see you safely home. Now, get up. I... I mislaid my hammer. I think Beonton ran off with it, but I'm not... I'm not... Uh, I'm not well, Ava. I'll find your hammer. And then you'll come with me. I was on my way to Scarborough. If you find my hammer, bring it to me there. All right, everyone. So we got to find his hammer. Where is that? Okay. So we have a little ways to go. Let's hop back on the horse. Okay. So let's find and retrieve this hammer. Here we go. Not too far away. I think we should be able to find it pretty easily. As long as we can take our horse all the way there. I feel like Hafton's days are numbered. He is not doing so hot. That is for sure. He is really struggling right now. I don't know if it was the, really the lead cups or not. Um, but he is really struggling. I think there's more going on than just drinking out of a lead cup, you know? I think there's more going on than just that. Okay, so we should be pretty close to it up here. Oh, I was going to try and knock that down. It's hard to smash these little things on the back of a horse. There we go. <laughs> I was trying to collect those as I see them. Okay, so let's take a look around. So where is his hammer? Show me what lies ahead. Oh, of course his hammer's down there. We go up here and it's down there. Of course it is. Why would it not be? All right, so let's see if I can get the horse down there without breaking its poor legs. Come on, horse. There we go. Dude, this place is really frozen. This place is really freezing and frozen. I guess it is the north. It is cold. There's Bjont, guarding the hammer. Oh no, this poor dog. He needs help. Get out of here, wolves. Get out of here, wolves. Come on, one more. Come here, you. No, maybe two more. Oh, okay, that's the dog. I got him, puppy. Don't worry, I got him. What a good dog. Sitting here guarding the hammer. Half drunk needs his hammer. Huh, half drunk. I love it. <laughs> All right, where is our horse? Where is our horse, everyone? Okay, so we have a little ways to go. Well, let's get there. Here we go. Dude, that dog is just zooming. Alright guys, we gotta catch back up to the dog. Let's get it. I believe this is likely the location where we are heading. And there's a synchronization point up here too, so this looks like a pretty cool place. 
Looks like an old, like, broken down, abandoned castle here on the edge of the... The edge of the, uh... The mountain here, I don't know. Edge of the cliffside, I guess? It's pretty sweet, though. This is really cool. Scarborough, here we go. Alright, let's see what Hafton is... Doing up here. The lighthouse. Hafton awaits. Oh, is it a lighthouse? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe so. This hammer is not meant to be thrown, Halfton. Remember that next time. Ooh, I don't think he liked that response. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe not. <laughs> My father, Ragnar, he gifted this to me. Took it off a Finnish chief. Still warm with blood when he handed it to me. I had 14 winters. Ragnar Lothbrok was a great king. Finnish arrow killed my mother. A shield maiden she was. As fierce as a wolf swallowing the sun. My father swore to kill the men who took her from us. And he did. Fourteen against one. But that was years ago in the east. And this is the west, where my father lies dead. A pile of bones in a pit of snakes. And here we are. Still telling stories of his life and deeds. How did my brother die? I'll say he died a warrior. With his hand on his axe, awaiting the maidens of the battle slain. Now he drinks at our father's side, awaiting the war at the end of days. Beonton, my boy! <laughs> Come here, boy! A dog always forgives, but he needs you home. All of Northumbria does. <clears throat> Do a last thing for me. Light the beacon for all to see, and let it burn. Alright everyone, so we need to light the brazier. I think that's how you say that. Oh, okay guys. Didn't mean to get in the uh to get, me, get, get the bean to get in the haystack. I can't I can't get that out, you know? For some reason that was a hard sentence for me to say. <laughs> Alright, let's get up here and light this thing. And then we will do the synchronization point real quick. Let's do the sync before we actually light this thing. I think that'll probably be better just in case it triggers some sort of animation. Some sort of uh cutscene. Dude, this is going to be one of the coolest ones yet, I have the feeling. Just because I love the snow. I just love the snow. I did one in Jorvik. I don't think I showed it on video, but it was one of my favorite ones as well. Just because Jorvik is so, so pretty. I think I like it so much because it reminds me of Skyrim and just the snowy, the snowy towns and cities of Skyrim. It's just beautiful. Okay, everyone, we can't do the leap of faith just yet. We won't be able to light this. Alright, alley -oop. Okay, let's light this thing. Pull out our torch, and... Oh, okay. I guess it... I guess it did it for me. Alright, everyone. Now we can do the leap of faith. Let's get it. Here we go. Oh, we got some nice stuff. Alright, now we hit the sleep of faith. Boom, baby. Thank you, friend. You are always welcome at my hall. Alright, I guess that's gonna be it then. Okay. Lost glory complete then. I guess they're headed home, everyone. There is a mystery down here. Should we check it out and see what it is? Those are always interesting. Let's check it out real quick before we leave. Since we're already here, we might as well. I haven't shown a lot of these because usually they're pretty short. Um, there's a few good ones that I've played, but most of them are just sort of meh. I don't know. They're not all great. Um, but I have played some interesting ones. But I figured I'm going to mainly stick to the main story in this game. But, you know, while we're here, might as well show this one. Did you hear that sound after I pushed the rock down? That fisherman was asking me 
Okay, well, dang, I wasn't going to kill them, but they just started attacking me. Well, I was not going to kill them. I thought I was going to talk to them. There we go. Well, see ya. Ooh, that had to hurt. That has to hurt. Oh, man, that has to hurt. Oh, dang you. Come here, Kira. Why are you running? Why are you running? Okay, I'm not exactly sure what the mystery was. Oh wait, maybe that wasn't the mystery. Maybe they weren't the mystery. Oh, maybe the mystery's down here. That's probably what it is. To death. An unlucky way to die. Doubt he felt much. Dang, they pushed the rock off the edge and killed this poor dude? Oh, that sucks. Oh, that really sucks. Alright, everyone. Um, I'm not exactly sure what is left for this mission, Lost Glory. I don't know if it actually ended or or what. Um, but I will see you all whenever we, you know, get to the next location or we start the next mission. So I'll see you then. So we are back in Ravensthorpe. I figured we would come back after that mission and we would try and find a new location that we can pledge to. And uh, hopefully we can get another alliance or another allegiance, however they're called. I don't exactly remember. <laughs> I guess it's one and the same. All right, here we go. Alright, so let's see, the, see alliance the alliance, the alliance map. map. So I know I'm definitely going to be under-leveled for whatever location that we're going to choose. And it is however you pronounce that one, or Snottinghamshire, so we're probably going to have to do this one next. I'm, like I said, I'm a little bit under-leveled for it, which is fine. Um, I've been under-leveled for most of the game. I don't really think it makes a difference. What it is what it is. Gloucestershire. You may have noticed that Gunnar has disappeared from his forge. He has traveled to Gloucestershire in search of a wife. A wife? He is in love. When did this happen? When doesn't this happen with our dear, lovelorn blacksmith? But there is a bright side. He has asked you to join him. Join his search for a wife. And see that he does not make a fool of himself. I believe he thinks that your presence would bolster his image. All right, well, let's make the pledge. Here we go. I'm gonna help our man Gunner find some love. <laughs> the matchmaker, baby. All right, I'll be Gunner's keeper. If only to bring him back in one piece. Very generous of you. Make for the town of Gloucester. You will find him there. All right, everyone, well, let's head that way, and uh, let's try and find Gunner, and let's help him find love. <laughs> all right, I'll see you all when we get there. Here we are, everyone. So we're in the territory of Gloucestershire. I'm hoping we're going to find the city. Here we go. Yes, we have found it. So he is at the west side of the town, everyone, so I think we should be getting close. I just need to... Search around a little bit. We'll head to the western side. We're searching for Gunner. What do you see? Okay, so there's a lot of things going on here, obviously, but uh, we need to find Gunner. Where might he be? So it says he's in the western side of town. That's where I'm heading. I'm heading west. Where might he be? Alright, we found him. Alright, everyone, we have found him. Okay, horse, I wish he would speed up just a little bit so we can get there a little quicker. Just a little bit faster would be nice. Okay, am I allowed to go this way? Okay, I thought they were going to try and kill me if I came over here, but I guess not. I guess we're good. Okay, so this is the first time we've been to this town. Very interesting. It's a lot different than the rest. And with a smile like I haven't seen in some time. Over here. Ooh, this must be his lady friend. Eivor, thought I smelt you under wind. Gunnar, with the speed you left home, I thought you'd been carried off by Valkyries. I have. This Valkyrie right here, Bridget, my own heart's root. Meet Eivor, 
It takes a rare woman to nail down our gunner. Lavendine da, with my Zigwili. Uh, I don't good to meet you as think well. she speaks the same language. How did you find a woman in these backwoods? She came through the settlement selling runes, outshone every stone in her satchel. She offered me a trade, a rune for a brooch I was making. I got a better deal. But she loves the ugly little thing. Have you uh, a family, Bridget? That mama dad carried Evan Gilly the Nanon. Couldn't have drews me. Bridget man power the last high priestess and elder man. They since passed on. But the current elderman looks out for her. I should like to meet this elderman of yours, if our kinfolk are to be joined. A union forged in love. Come, we go find him. Oh, and don't blame me if he's heard a tale or two about you. What about it, Bridge? Tim Jolch, you two bags of Irish sea hogumpas killed. So she speaks English, but with a really rough, like, accent, and I don't understand. <laughs> right? No daylight to waste, then, huh? All right, everyone, well, let's follow him and let's see where so he's going to go. the elder man may have heard a tale or two about my exploits. Not all from me. Your name will be on the lips of every skull for years to come. Hmm. And the Mercians here are not unsettled by lurking Viking yet? They come from all over to celebrate Samhain. Most are too busy with the festivities to pay us mine. Samhain? Is that what these carved roots are for? This tradition? Aye. Faces cut into lanterns to ward off evil spirits and guide children home. They have a haunted look about them. Let us bring a few back. Is it like Halloween? Is it like jack-o'-lanterns, I wonder? Sort of seems like that's what it is. Alright, let's hop on off. Well, Gunner's found him a nice woman. She doesn't really speak very clearly, but uh, she seems nice. There is the elder man. Kunan! A good leader. Seeing to his people's needs. Let us join hands when his task is done. Yeah. Then let's introduce you to Tevdur. Guess he has a lot of people for us to meet. Hands as clammy as a dead haddock, but his heart is in the right place. And he'll be Elderman after Kunan. Tevdur, this is Eber, my chieftain. Ah, uh, yes. The way Gunner speaks, I expected, uh... Me to ride in on a winged horse, cure the sick, the blind. His compliments are as blunt as his hammer. Ah, more pagans crowding our table. Just lovely. Well, what brings you here? My friend's I'm wedding. I'm here to hasten my friend's marriage and drink my weight in ale. If friendship comes afterwards, then all the better. And what has Dane friendship done for Christian Mercia? Unseated god right kings for puppet rulers? So-called puppet kings keep your lands safe and your bellies full. I ask no thanks. Only hospitality. Apples! Eivor, wait until you try the cider. I have a feeling you, this you isn't like going to go well. Eh? Tevder? Cider? Ah, you must be Eivor. Tevder, I see you've welcomed our honored guest. Come just in time for my last Samhain. At your behest. We welcome all pagans set upon God's own Gloucester. Tevder, as your harvest king, I demand that you remove the turnip from your arse and be merry. I like this guy. So I think Eivor does as well. Family. Before you whisk my Bridget away to her life as a smithy's bride. We're honored to have her join the Raven Clan. But your lush landscape will be hard to match. We must give away girl and land in this misty season. But Gunnar is a good man, and he speaks tirelessly of you. If you will excuse me, I have matters to attend to. Ah, yes, the shrine. And with so many thieves and fangs on the path. A fellow may fall in God's service. Kunon, 
I do not need a heathen escort. Youth cut down in its prime, without even the memory of warm thighs and cider to sustain him in the afterlife. Then, by my honor, I shall not rest until I return him to you safely. Aye, right, Tefter? I see I am outmatched. Though a Dane joining in praise to Saint Kenhelm, God will weep. My lady love calls, Eivor. Oh, if you'd like to join us later, we're going hoodening this eve. Go, may you have a fire-forged friendship. Watch for fairies, fenfolk, and fiends. I have a hand fastening to oversee, an apprenticeship to officiate, and a pig to slaughter. Dang, it's a busy day for everybody, it sounds like. <clears throat> well, shall we then? I think we shall. A tale of wicker fire. Gloucester Chester Shahia. <laughs> Sour. <laughs> Kunon humors these pagans too much. It is the first thing gone when I am Elderman. Fires and magic. Spirits in the air. Gloucestershire has strayed from God's light. People need carousing, especially before the winter frost. A festival brings warmth and cheer. Dude, these people live like hobbits. This is so chill. cool. But the winters are hard upon the children. Seeing them run around, it lightens the heart. Are there Dude, it's actually super lands? cool, man. I've met a few. Liked even fewer. The profane has gone unchallenged here. I alone am the reformation. They are a flock in need of my shepherding. And how will you lead this great renewal? They will fill the church's pews and we will thank him for all the gifts he brings. Not false idols of wood and clay. And yet, are we not going to pray at the idol of another? Is this Saint Canom your god? No, and we do not call him such. He is simply closer to the Lord's ear. Lo, in a mead of kine under a thorn, lieth poor Kenhelm, kingborn. Is this land not beautiful, Eivor? Aye. Look, the path is untouched by danger, so your company is not needed. You are a kinder man than the mask you wear. But you won't be rid of me. I will keep my word to Kunin for your safe return. It actually is a really beautiful land, that's for sure. I don't understand interrupt this Christian praying. I thank Odin while standing. Why get your knees dirty? To humble ourselves before God. Besides, I've dirtied my knees doing worse. That sounds like a tale I'd like to lend my ear to. Please, Eivor, I okay, must Eivor, pray. Okay, Eivor, what in the world? Should I watch or turn my back? Oh, Lord, gift upon this lowly servant, your greatest gift. Patience. Oh, never ask for patience. I will not have to interrupt your prayer to protect you, Tefter. And yet you insist on doing so. What is it you are looking at? A hair? Tefter, get to safety. Oh, dude, I have no arrows, line. of course. Where did they come from? Well, I'm gonna use this ability. I'll have some arrows. Stab it. Okay, I think we got him. Thankfully, you don't actually need arrows to use the arrow ability, which is nice. <laughs> Eivor, thank you for saving my life. It's good I was here to protect you. Maybe Kunan has the eyes of prophecy. Splude. Cloven hoofed and sent by Lucifer himself. This land must be returned to God's grace. More likely the shrines in their territory. Lord, we thank thee for your protection. It's not safe here. Give me my moment's prayer, Eivor. I ask only this. We should return to Gloucester. Unless you'd like to thank the little martyr here for tonight's feast. I'm not a babe in the woods in need of constant God. Go on without me. I gave Kunan... Yes, yes, your word. And when I see him, I will say you protected me from being skewered upon those devil's tusks. Oh, and Eivor, I owe you a drink at least. Later, if you'd have one, find me at the festivities. Alright everyone, let's get back to Gunner. I think we've done enough for him. Hopefully there won't be any more 
hogs come and try and skewer him. That would be very bad. That would not be keeping our word. How do I get back over here? Wait, I don't actually know where I'm going. What in the world am I doing here? I think we can probably cut across this water right here. Alright, let's head back to Gunner. Not too far away. Dude, I really love their houses that they live in. It really is like Hobbit homes. I love it. They're like built into the dirt. It's really cool. Not all of them are, but a lot of them. Like, look at that. I mean, it makes so much sense. Like, it even makes like... I don't know. It even makes like sense in terms of... I don't know, the environment, I guess. You could probably do that right now to be good. Eivor, there you are. Here I am. So, what adventures did you find in my absence? Escorted Tefter to the shrine of some Christian saint. Our path was not peaceful. We were accosted by a group of boars. Odd, but path now usually south. To the Grivo. But you saved his hide. I bet it was quite the sight, two of you as a pair. Definitely need a drink. I need a drink. Try the cider. It's from last year's apple harvest. Sounds Skull. pretty good. Skull. So, you invited me to a hoodening. What mischief is this? Nigwiskal Anvil is spread down in Creatures of the Vale. To bag for treats. Creatures of the veil to bag for treats. Flowers to give their glut to otherworldly visitors, and if you dress as one, you'll get that bounty yourself. Freely given? Huh. I have only seen such a thing done at feasts. Then we turn you into a beastie and have you roam the hills, braying for sweets and drink. Oh, I guess. Let's do it, I guess. It's hardly a disguise. Just a cloak and some bones. Nonsense. You are the very spirit of the Mary Lubed. Now, let's hooden. Become the Mary Lubed, the spirit who sings for cake and ale. And you cannot have your cloak back until we leave. I'll keep this covering, but even a knife to my throat cannot make me sing on command. Shay. I heard your voice clear as a bell. Locks fall from the sky in envy. Gunner, if no one else is dressed this way, I will fill your shop with sheep. Oh, we're going trick or treating, guys. What the heck? It literally is Halloween. Trick or treat. What business have you? Oh, the Mary Lewid. Right, right. We're doing cakes instead of beer this year. Sour night and the moon is high. Mary Lewid haunts my door. The air is chilling, and ghosts are spilling all across the misty moor. Oh, ghosts and beasties. Here, spirit, take your reward. Oh, dude, that is so cool. We're legitimately trick-or-treating right now. What the heck? Can tricks the spirits see? The eye holes in this mask are terrible. All it takes is a mask and some sweet cakes to turn you into a gentle skull. <gasps> I am not going to sing, Gunnar. Mm -hmm. Is this a door we can knock on? No. Oh, here is a door we can knock on. Oh, is that one big house? Dude, these houses are sweet, man. I would, I would literally want to live here. These are huge houses underground. If they were built correctly, these would be amazing. Are you ready to rhyme with me? Down the road from my abode, there is an open veil. Hope to God this Mary Lewis doesn't fail. Oh, have a cake for your troubles then. Oh, I feel like... Well, this is moldy cheese. This isn't cake. I don't want moldy cheese. Scaring the wee one. In the midst of the night, they saw a woman. All right, do we have another house to knock on? I think this is a door we can knock on right here. Eivor, mighty warrior, knocker of doors. Victor of cakes. How does it feel to pillage what is freely given? Knock knock, trick or treat. Dude, we're literally going trick or treating in Assassin's Creed. Oh, thank the gods. 
We've been waiting for children all night to empty our store so we can go to the party. Have some extra. <laughs> Look at these cakes. Sweet as honey, Gunnar. You should see this. Gunnar. Wait, where'd he go? My cakes. Wait, where did Gunnar go? And these are not cakes. We're getting moldy cheese, guys. This is not a cake. Moldy cheese is not a cake, okay? I'm not sure who said that moldy cheese was a cake, but moldy cheese is not, in fact, a cake, okay? Not a cake. Wait, where was he at? Was he over here? Have a look, Sunan. Oh, there's a key to something, though. That's for sure. Let me see where does this key go. Give me this key. I think this key is gonna open this door. Pagan house key door. Ooh, I steal their treasure. Happy Halloween, everyone. Now that was a trick. That was not a treat. One of the little folk asked me to make the door smaller as he wants to keep unruly house guests from his house. Okay, guys, I have a question, though. So they, they sleep right there on the floor. Why do they have such... I feel like I'd want a better bed than that. I would want to try to make a better bed. I feel like that would not be a comfortable place to sleep. Damn this Serta. You are either fearless or stupid, boy, to speak to someone of the Raven Clan this way. Fitting name for scavengers. Winged rats taking what isn't yours. I'll pick out your eyes and feed them to your god. Gunnar, we are guests here. Let him go. We can hooden more. You seem to want your nose broken, so let me oblige. Christ, I'm tall. I love how it just says unintelligible every time she speaks, even though you can kind of understand her after a little bit of time. It's you lot we should be burning alive. Oh, dang, he just WWE'd me, son. On the top rope, baby. Are you sure you don't want to stay in Glowichester? They know how to have fun. Dude, I would want to stay here. This place is sweet, man. But I guess it's not his people, so I mean, I guess you wouldn't want to stay where your people are. But this place is really sweet. This may be one of my favorite locations we've been so far. This in Jorvik. The Jorvik. But I feel like it's so cold. In Jorvik. Oh, dang it. This dude is insanely good. Come here, man. Go to sleep. Four spears. My leg. Guna. Crap, dude. He's hurt his leg. Oh, man. That's not good. Enough. Keep your brawls to the other side of the river. There's children about. I don't answer to you, witch. Thomas Fletcher. I brought you into this world. Wiped your mother's birth blood from your face. Mind your tongue. That's one way to shut somebody up. Let's see that leg then. It's nothing. Careful with the old man. He's had many winters worth of wounds. Tilukis. Modron's a compass to patch this land. Will he walk again? The gash is deep. If I cannot save the leg, the pigs will eat well tonight. That man called you a witch. I lead those who follow the old ways in Gloucestershire, but I offer my healing services on both sides of the river. Gwenith, my love, go back to the house and bring me the garlic salt. And the worms? Are we cleaning or cutting, mother? Yes, grab the worms just to be safe. Now go, child. I promise not to cut it off before your return. I give me strength. My mom modern is known I'm a humor towish gutran. I'm glad you're all finding my mortal injury so funny. Go, Aver. Make Marion try to loosen Tevter's shoulders. Modern, you don't have to save his leg. I will understand. That limb will be fine. But no medicine in England will stop the dribble from his mouth. I do not work miracles. I love the banter between everybody in this in this game. A lot of fun. Okay, so where are we going? We're going across the river. All right, let's jump on over there and swim on over, and let's get to having some fun. You know, I think that's what we need to do. All right, so where are we heading? Over here. All right, let's see if we can go have some fun. Do we still have this thing on our face? No, we don't. We actually got to take it off. Okay. All good. So how much further we got? 
Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to push you to the ground, my friend. That was uh, pretty rude, to be completely honest with you. Oh, please let me climb up here, Eivor. Come on over, Eivor. There we go, that's what I was trying to do. Alright, so we're looking for... I don't have no idea how to say his name. Tedway? With bitter ale and sweet friends. That is a fine way to end the day. Yo, who is this guy? Alone, with your thoughts at last. Eivor! <laughs> Perhaps. Every moment is sweeter when you are the Harvest King. All this bounty. Soon, I will join it. But eat, drink. Enjoy all that Glowichester's lush woods offer. Alright, before we start that, I'm gonna go over here and speak to this person as well. I thought the church condemned this celebration. I hate the church. Name's Gwilim, and I turned to God just three years back. You look like a man with a past. What were you before you took up the cloth? Me? A, a, a grain farmer. Had to take up the sword a few times to protect my crops. Well, why become a monk? What brought you to God? You know you need to change after the third night you wake up britchless in pig shit with no idea how you got there. Do you like Gloucester? Ah, tis a beauteous place. Shame they're losing their elderman. All right, well, I guess we'll say goodbye. Enjoy the festival, Gwilym. Ah, perhaps a drink later. I think everybody wants to have a drink, huh? All right, let's speak to this guy. Eivor, there you are. Tefter, you're well met. Gwilym here has challenged my honor in a contest of drinks. Join us. The lab will be easy pickings. All right, let's do it. Give me a cup. Some ale, then. One for me as well. Gwilym, the warrior monk. Now we can match wills with a flagon in hand. <laughs> Ale is known to blunt even the sharpest of blades, Eivor. To holy hearths and humid eyes, it is the best drunkenness returns a man to royal reason. Skull. Sometimes Eivor says some things so poetic I don't even know what he's talking about. <laughs> he's almost as in unintelligible as the other lady. All right, here we go. Drinking contest. Oh my god, this is the longest drinking contest I've ever seen on this game. This is insane. I'm going to definitely lose this one. This one's so long. Six of them deep, man. We're going six deep. I'm already leaning after... On the second one? Dude, this is crazy. At least he's... How come he doesn't slow down when he starts stumbling? Come on, Eivor, don't you dare. You're going to start. Dude, I'm actually doing pretty well, though. I'm actually killing it a little bit. Can't lie, we're actually killing it. Very hard to not flick the left joystick and hit the A button at the same time. Very hard not to do that at the same time, even though you don't really need to. Staggering all Dude, I think we're actually killing it, though. This is pretty good. One of the best ones I've ever done, for sure, as long as I don't screw it up here at the end. Dude, that was destroyed right there. I destroyed. That was insane. Good effort, Tefner. <laughs> this merriment feeds my soul. Here, another drink on me for allies new and old. Of all the Eldermen I've met, you're the most unburdened. What is your secret? None. It is well known. The burdens I carry will soon leave this world with me. So drink to my life and death. Death? I am to be sacrificed in the Wicker Man as King of the Harvest. Like Elderman Simkin before me and all before him. Horrible barbaric practice. A burnt offering after poor crops. They hope well-fed gods will smile upon them. Dude, that is chaotic. Then cheers. A toast, then. To Elderman Coonan, joyous and generous. Let each man show him loyalty until he suffers death. My friends, you are kind to me. 
I'd like to toast my successor, Kevgar. May he wear the horns head high. Yeah, if I was the Elderman, I would definitely not be uh, letting myself get burnt alive for the harvest. I think we'd figure out another way. Okay, I think we'd definitely figure out another way. I don't think I'm down to get burnt alive, you know? It's just not my thing. Weak. What is this? Water? I feel like Thor chugging oceans. No effect to my head or step. <laughs> you had the man. Give him something stronger. <laughs> this will work faster than any tonic. Good. Give me visions of all creatures that roam these hills, and the sore head tomorrow to pay for it. Wow, that tastes awful. It feels good though. Hey, boss, speak true. My feelings be damned. I have been an ass. Do not deny it. And I, for that, I am sorry. A colossal horse's ass. Yes. Soft words from a heartless heathen. Only fiercer than fire among ill friends. I can be very as nice as a spring gale. <laughs> and how nice is that? Oh, shoot, we got another romance, everybody. You know what? Since Sigurd has returned, Ranvi just hasn't been showing Eivor the affection that he wants. We tried to initiate with her, and she was like, not while Sigurd's there. It's like, what's the difference between when he's there and he's gone, you know? So there you go. Eivor is spreading his wings. I think I might like you even better when you're me. Tefta, with Gunnar and Bridget's marriage... Our clans will unite, but we could join by oath as well. Oh, yes. My first ally as Elderman. I accept. We shall make an oath. How do we start? Yeah. The greatest, greatest oath and the greatest union. To the oath. The treaty. The greatest. I have no idea what they're talking about, everyone. I have no clue. I thought we were doing a romance. <laughs> oh, I guess we are. Okay. People are sleeping. More ale to seal our friendship. <laughs> this way, this way. Look out for the black sow. Sow? Like pig? Flaming pig. Chases you home at night. <laughs> Silly words to scare silly children. Dude, what is going on here? You see magic as the stuff of children's dreams. Perhaps I judge too much. Proves I half believe. Foolishness. Oh, Avor, you gotta get up. My tongue. I have to piss. Uh, a great blackness chases stars across the sky. In great worlds of color and light. Dude, this is insane. Whoosh. They are just destroyed. Here we are. Right inside here. I feel warm. Do you feel warm? Always warm here. It's a wonder you don't walk around naked. Yes. Um. Well. Come on in. Dude, where are we going? I can't find the way to where I'm supposed to go. Tefter! Tefter! I think we lost him, everybody. Tefter! Where are you? <laughs> I don't think, uh, I don't think it worked out at for Eivor and Tedver. Oh, there he is. What is happening here? <gasps> yeah, bro. Chickens are mean, man. They will chase you back. You chase them, they will chase you back.
I don't think much romance is getting done. I don't think much Hell's romance wrath. got done. <laughs> what happened last night? Ah, uh, you got a little bit. Oh, um, uh, is that blood? And the effects of that draft still cling. Drafter, are you here? Let's see. I am to be elderman. The father said that the heart, that though the heart, my heart lies with the cloth here in Wickenby, the Lord has needed me elsewhere. Heresy, devil worship, and hedonism plagues Gloucestershire, Gloucestershire, whatever. I don't know. Proper like locusts. I just hope they will be my willing lambs. Okay. Um, what happened here? Left his bodyguard, killed by knife. Yeah, and you have blood on your hands, Eivor. That's not good. Blood. Could be Tefters, if he was the heavy thing being dragged. Oh, but there's a pig here in the corner and a chicken. Okay, I don't want to go outside just yet. Let's move this. Oh, come on, move this, please. We got some more investigation to do. Avor's still feeling it. Muddy footprints. Someone was hiding back here. What's happened here? Open this door. Come out of there. Okay, they want to find Tedwe. Uh, why can't I investigate this? I see something I can investigate, but it won't let me. Please let me. Oh no, I'm not going to be able to. Guys, I'm trying to investigate this, but it won't let me. Oh, there we go. Willem's pouch. I wonder if it still has its little something stronger. But why is it here? Better hold on to it. Okay, we have a little bit more investigation to go. Where is it? Okay, I missed something over here. This part has been broken, and it's covered in blood. A weapon, maybe. So, what does this lead to? All right, Detective Avor, put it together. Here, lying in wait while we approach that side. They jumped from the shadows to kill the bodyguards and to disable Tefta. Then they dragged him away. That accounts for everything, except Gwilym's pouch of herbs. I'm still unbalanced by Gwilym's special something. Maybe Mother Modron will know the contents. Okay, let's see if we can find her. What is the meaning of this? Blood soaking our soil, and your weapon coated in the same! Kunan, please. More has happened here than you can see. Give me a right to parley my innocence. I should have heeded Tevder's misgivings about heathen party guests, and now he has paid with his life. With Tevder gone, Glowichester will be without an elderman. Eye for an eye, your Raven clan will lose their chieftain! Get the murderer! Oh, they think they're gonna kill me? Oh, that's hilarious. That is so funny. That is funny they think that's gonna happen, because it's not gonna happen. Oh, you got more? You got this big dude coming after me? You got this big dude coming after me? I don't think so either. I mean, I'm a little drunk, but you know, Eivor still got it. Ow, that kind of hurt a little bit, actually. There we go. Well, what do you got? A little off balance, huh? You're just a little off balance there, aren't you? And I'll be seeing you, my friend. Crank that neck, son. Ooh, that, that those sounds are so not good to hear. I hate hearing those sounds. Oh, that was sick. I love that animation. Where you can throw the weapon. Okay, how many people do I gotta fight here? Who's shooting me with an arrow right now? 
I'm not sure. Can't use my raven, guys. We need to get out of here. I'm just gonna run. Get in the heck out of here, guys. I'm running. I'm not sure how many people I'm gonna have to fight here. Ow, okay, I see where he's shooting me from. You don't get the run, Mr. Archer guy. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, sorry, 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 civilian. Okay, now I really am a murderer. Sorry, Mr. Civilian, I didn't mean to. Near the river, separating... Okay, so we need to run toward the river. I think it's back this way, right? I don't exactly remember. Okay, guys. Raven is available now. Okay. We need to go this way. Crap, guys. This is so bad. They think we killed the new elderman, and I'm on fire. Avor, your leg is on fire, my friend. And I'm still half drunk. What a disaster, guys. This is such a mess. Okay, I, I, w I wish I could just put my gun, uh, not my gun, my, my sword away here. Everyone's screaming and afraid. Nothing to be afraid of, nothing to be afraid of. Okay, is this her right here? There's Motan up ahead. Hello again. Mother, it's the friend of the mangled leg man. Eivor, you remember? Oh, we have the mask Indeed. on. It's a surprise to see you. Is everything quite all right? No, it's not. I awoke in Tefter's wrecked home. Blood, but no body. Kunin's men are after me for the lad's murder. Uh-oh. Did you stab him? Mother, can I see? Blood, but no body? We must see what has happened to him. Do you recognize the contents of this pouch? A very unusual blend. There is a druid who uses this mix to aid sleep. A monk called Gwillem poured some of it into my drink last night. The effects were intense. Search the houses! Can't have gotten far! Well, crap, we're gonna have to you. fight again. If they know I've aided you, it'll be my head next. Can you? I've seen nothing and no one. Mother, if the stranger wants more of the herbs, they can talk to the druid Halewin. Yes. Halewin's cabin is on a lake near where the Cherwell and Great Ouse rivers meet. But he is a strange fish. Rarely does he speak to mortals, preferring the company of spirits. Now, I have business at Rollandrich. Find me there later. Alright everyone, so we need to meet him. We need to meet Helewyn. And uh, I guess I will see you all when we find him. I'll see you then. Thank you.